Hey everyone, in today's video, we are going to be controlling an Android device from an iOS device. So, the first thing we're going to do is set up the Android device to actually be remotely accessed. First thing you have to do is go to the Google Play Store and download VMLite VNC Server. Now, this is $10. It's only $10 for one time as long as you're signed into the same account on all of your devices. You can also do Google Family Sharing to actually have different accounts as long as they're connected to the same family library. So I already have this installed. I'm going to go ahead and open it up. And as long as your device is rooted, clicking start will be no problem. It's going to ask you for super user permissions and then your IP address is going to show on the screen. If you're not rooted, you have to go to their website, which I'll leave in the description to download a controller, connect this to a USB port on your computer, and then go through the process of actually enabling this. But since I have root, I don't have to worry about this, I recommend you root all of your cache devices if that's what you're doing this on. Then in the settings panel, I always change the VNC port from this, this is going to be the default right here, 5901 to 5900 because that's the default and in the viewer we don't have to enter that which you'll see in a little bit. Then down at the screen rotation, I like to auto correct the rotation that won't be checked. This will not be checked as well. Start server on boot. I like that. That's also only for rooted devices and keep screen on won't be checked. I like to have that. So after that point, it's going to say, hey, your settings have changed. You have to restart the server. And from that point, this is set up for remote access with its internal IP address. So Leave that there, take note of the, the actual IP address, and I'm going to go on to my iOS device, which I'm going to be using this to control the Android, but you can use any kind of device as long as you download the same software I'm about to download. It's called VNC Viewer. It can be found on the App Store. If you're on a computer, it can be found on their website. Just type in VNC Viewer on the App Store. It's the first one from Real VNC. And from that point, once you open it, you go through the tutorial, you need to add a connection. And the address is going to be just the IP address. We don't have to worry about entering the port as it shows here in the default because this is a 5900 port, which is the default for VNC. So 192.168.105. For the name of it, I'm just gonna call it Android One. Normally it would be the actual numbering system that I'm using for that device. Uh, but we're not doing that with this money-making device. So save. Picture quality, I do low all the time because I'm more concerned with speed and otherwise everything else should be good. I'm going to go ahead and connect to this. It's going to warn you about an unencrypted connection. I always swipe that off because I don't care and I don't want to see that again. And since I didn't set a password, it, it immediately took me to the device and I can control it from here. Uh, but if you would have a password, you have, you'd have to enter that first, obviously. And that is how you connect to an Android device when you're on the same network as this iOS device is on the same network as the Android device. Now, if you're off the network, I recommend you set up a VPN on the router that this Android device is on. And, and then you can connect to the VPN no matter where you are and use the same IP address. I'd also recommend setting up a static IP so this IP address of the Android doesn't change. But information about both of these things can be found on the overview video I made about remote access, which I'll leave in your cards right now. But anyway, that's all for this video. And I'll talk to you guys later with more money-making videos and videos like these. But in the meantime, have fun making money remotely. Thank you for watching this video. I meant to help you make more money with smartphones and computers. Above me is a link to my website with a getting started Started series for all of you that are brand new to this. Any more specific questions can be directed to me at the contact page or on any of the community 